Hey guys, KT here. Welcome back to some more Soul Calibur 4. Last time we played as Mitsurugi, and now we're going to be playing as Sandra, uh, who I think is the daughter of Sophitia. So let's get started and see what her story brings us into. Now, I really like the ending for Mitsurugi. Now, I'm very curious what this one's going to be about. Cassandra set out once again for the town she had visited before the Eastern Europe, hoping to find more clues that would lead her to Soul Edge. But as she hurried through the night, a man appeared before her. His eyes were stained red. She was reminded of the story she had heard about a swordsman who had led the man f townsfolk. <laughs> yeah, led the mad townsfolk. You have the piece of Soul Edge, don't you? I can feel it, the man said, and in an instant he was upon her. After a hard fight, she was able to finally land a blow on her assailant. assailant. But he only sneered at Cassandra and vanished. So, woman, you can ward off evil, though not as strong as the Holy Stone. Interesting. I'll let you live for now. You're going to run, you coward. A laugh echoed around her. I already have what I came for. Panic, Cassandra searching her tunic. But the fragment of the cursed sword was gone. Unnerved at first, Cassandra pushed those unhelpful feelings down and headed for the town, where she discovered some townsfolk still retained for their sanity. In fact, they had been healed by a shining blue crystal. Could it be the holy stone the swordsmen had mentioned? She set out to learn more, and then rumor caught her attention. A man carrying a mass of crystals, as tall as himself, was on his way to Orstrandberg. If the crystal he bore had the power to smite evil, then that could only mean some evil present lurked in the ruined castle there. Was it Soul Edge? Cassandra decided to follow the man to Orstergberg and find out. Okay, so not gonna even talk about who, if Sophitia and Cassandra are like mother daughter. I'm not 100% sure. I'm pretty sure they are, though, if I am correct. I could be 100% wrong. You guys are probably already told me in the comments they are related they or whatever. I don't know. Foolish girl. You do not belong here. You again? Ugh, I've had enough of you. Stage start. Oh my god. I feel like I'm missing like a whole bunch of story, mainly because I've never... Um... I've never played the previous games, and I feel like I'm missing a lot of story because of that aspect. Wait, did she just run and hit the person where they're ass? What? Hold on. You stay right there. Oh my gosh, she freaking does an ass slam. Oh my god. That's actually interesting that the, that the character would actually do that. Oh my god. Imagine, like, having a creative character and that's they, w one of the moves. It's like, wow. I'm usually used to slides, not an ass slap. Or slam, whatever you want to call it. Oh, come on. Come on, KT, we got this. Wait, what am I doing? Okay, there's my taunt. It's like a little walk. Wow. Now who doesn't belong? Okay, let's see. You have encountered. Okay, so I've been I've encountered a rock. Okay. So what does that mean? Can I summon like a giant boulder to help? Like it just comes down and just smashes my opponents. Oh my god. That'd be hilarious. I mean, seriously. Just have some, uh... Assistance, some allies. The cursed Marvel vs. Capcom. Just one thing after another. I'm getting tired of this. Shut up! I'll destroy you! Why? Stage, start. Why would you destroy me? I mean, we're... I'm just trying to be friends here. Oh! Oh! Correct! 
stab me in my crotch? What? Did she just vagina stab me? That's... What the frick? You're crazy. Hey, at least Brock has uh, full health. That's actually very, uh, very pleasing for once. Where uh, one of my side characters actually have full health. Oh god. This guy is slow. Oh my god. Like, Jesus. How are you that slow, Rock? Stage completed. Sophia, where are you? Now that I think about it, what if they are sisters? Sophitia and... and Cassandra. Oh my god, this is very confusing. I don't know! Okay, we'll see. I don't I'm not 100 percent sure anymore. But Jesus, Rock is more like a character you'd use to like knock people oh, off the map. Prepare yourself! Stage start. <laughs> Yeah, I'm not dealing with that. Oh, yes! Wrecked! With a perfect two! You just got wrecked! That felt great! I mean, yeah, when you get a perfect, of course it feels great. I mean, I've. Ah! Rock! I just wanted you as my rock! Now, that sounds weird. Okay, so we're going against Sophitia. Uh, Dwer and Azula. Now, in the Sophitia storyline, Azula would already be gone. So I cannot turn back. I will fight you if I must. Sophitia, open your eyes. Stage start. Wait. Okay, so this version of Sophitia actually has has like the blade of Soul Edge. Okay, so she's not even. Like she's possessed by Soul Edge. That's kind of, kind of hilarious, actually. Oh come on, no! Okay, I I suck. So either so since she's possessed by Soul Edge, I don't know if like we're going against. Soul, I don't even think we're going against Soul Edge here. I I don't know. Maybe we are. Maybe we aren't. Maybe we're going after Soul Caliber because. It did talk about following a guy with a giant uh, crystal sword, so it might actually be uh, Siegfried. But yeah, I don't, I don't know anything about Cassandra and Sophia's history and how they know each other. I don't, I don't know. I'm just guessing they're like related somehow, in some way. That's how I picture it. Get out of my sister's body. Okay, so they're sisters. Okay, thank God. Okay, that that clears up a whole lot. And for anyone commenting, now I feel like an idiot. Okay. And we're going against Algo. I thought we were going to go against Singfree, but apparently not. So, yeah, that's actually nice to know that they're sisters now. Um, the instead of what well, I thought. Please stand by me, Sophitia. I will destroy any that stand in my way. Stage so, start. From the way this was in Sophia's storyline, um, she did not get possessed by Soul Edge, and instead was able to break free and face Algol just to so she can destroy uh, the sword. And then you got uh, in Cassandra's story where she never. Uh, breaks free from Soul Edge's grasp, and Cassandra has to be the one to free her. Okay, that makes a little more sense. Get out of my way! I'm in a hurry. Are you? I mean, really? You're? I, I, I mean, that's the final guy. I wouldn't say you're in much of a ho hurry anymore. I mean, the hurry would have been like right at the beginning. <laughs>
With this, the evil presence will cease to exist. The perfect world will now be born. The evil presence? Well, there's still one left. Right here! Foolish girl! What do you think you are doing? You dare to extinguish the light of humanity just to suit yourself? After what you've done to Zofitia, you call yourself the light of humanity? Get serious! Let's go home, Sofitia. She carried out her conviction and protected the bonds of family. There will be, be peace as long as that belief remains. Okay, so really the swords were the ones who were causing the evil in the world. So really, Cassandra did a good thing. Oh my god, I don't even know, Jesus. <laughs> this story confuses me so much. But then again, I haven't played this game in forever. And even then, before I'd even read... Uh, before, or read the, even the intros before, so I won't even know the story, <laughs> which makes me look like an idiot, so I'm doing, like, a better job than I did before, but, okay. So, in the next part, we're gonna be playing as Raphael, which is gonna be, uh, very, very different. Uh, so yeah, I'll see you guys next time. Make sure to leave a like and subscribe, and, uh, check out the Facebook and the Twitter, and I'll see you guys next time. Bye!